Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Boone coming at you guys with such an exciting video. We have waited such a long time for this day to come. I've been in hibernation mode, sleeping like I'm dirty, damn, waiting on the day I could finally bless my eyes upon Supreme SS20. We are here. I am so excited. We're about to go through the lookbook together. This is one of my favorite videos to do on the channel, so drop a like if you guys enjoy. First off, let me know right away down in the comments what your favorite item is from this upcoming season. I won't lie, I have seen a few pieces, but I've been trying my very best to make sure I don't spoil the surprise of this season. I want you guys to see my genuine first reaction to all of these items. So let's just hop into this video. I really do not want to do a big intro, but I do got to shout out the Discord because we are about to be cooking it up all season long. Um, in the off season, we are building up our monitors. If you guys want to have monitors for this upcoming Supreme season, they actually work for like Adidas, every single foot site. We got sneakers, we got Palace, we got Funkos, we got every single monitor you could ask for. So if you guys wanna see restocks for the Supreme season, go join my Patreon. $2 a month gives you access to every single monitor. I also have been doing a lot of exclusive content on my Patreon. All my patrons just got to see my little exclusive sneak peek to my 10K Supreme Collection video. That's coming this week. Get ready, drop a sub if you're new to the channel. If you wanna join the Discord, um, just hit me up on my my Instagram at Boone with proof you sub to the channel. Let's begin this lookbook now. I am so excited. I hope you guys are too. Let's begin. I forgot to mention, I have a little hype camera set up. Hold up. I got a hype camera set up over here just in case I get too excited about an item and I need to come over here to celebrate its release, but we'll go back to that camera. Let's stay on the main camera for now and let's just begin looking through these items. I am so excited. You guys do not understand. I truly don't know what to do with myself when Supreme isn't releasing stuff for me to waste my money on. Saving money is so disgusting, bro. I need to waste this shit on bricks pronto. So let's begin this lookbook. We're gonna go section by section. I'm just gonna go over the items that like jump out to me because there's obviously a billion things. I can't go through every single item. Let me know if I miss anything. Um, let's start though. Faux fur varsity jacket. We are off to a good start, folks. Now the faux furs they've done lately, I've not been a fan of to be real. Like the Ganesh one, eh, like we really wasn't feeling it, but this, this is gorgeous to be real with you. Um, we got like the nice ass little var, this is more like a script logo, I guess. Um, I've seen this logo a lot on baseball jerseys. They put it on the faux fur, and I will say the yellow and the navy are just ooh, so hard. I've seen TJ in this. I actually posted this leak on my Seattle Select page. Go follow that, because I'm about to be selling a lot of Supreme on there. Um, but next up, these are kind of crazy, dude. I do not know what's going on with this, but ooh, okay. Kind of a vibe, I'm not gonna front. I hope that Supreme is embroidered, it looks to be. We got some crazy paint splatters. This is Gore-Tex, so like, I already can't afford it, Retail but to I'm actually kind of vibing Don't with this. I hope there's them. a pair of pants. I feel like this would look super cool on denim. I already know they're gonna disappoint me with pants, though. That's the one thing I can never get from Supreme. I'm just like, bro, I love pants. I need more pants. Supreme, give me good pants. I'm praying the pants section hits this season. Um, let's continue on, though. We got some anoraks, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. Okay, so this was an interesting one. This actually looks a lot like a Chrome Hearts design, but yeah, this is kind of crazy. I did see this one in the initial teaser photo. A lot of people hated on it, but to be honest, I'm kind of glad they did something different. Like, I don't know, I get tired of the normal Supreme spellouts and stuff. This is definitely a very original take on it. Um, this blue one's kind of hard too, like don't play with me. It's not that bad of a design, but we're gonna keep it moving. Um, okay, I gotta take a look, what is this? We got the Vanson leather jacket. Jacket. Oh no, it's Vance. Okay, well that's a wrap. I'm not gonna be able to afford this. Um, the Vance and leather jackets are always like guap. So unfortunately, I do love this design. I think it's a super cool take, but I cannot afford this, bro. I'm no way I'm buying this. I love it though. I actually am a big fan of this design. Oh, if they put that on pants, dog. Like I know they didn't. I know for a fact they didn't. There's no way. Um, shiny reversible puffy. This looks like some Montclair. Uh, I mean, it's it's cool. It's definitely not like trash, but for how much retail is gonna be, it's trash. All right, so let's keep moving. We're not worried about any of that. Oh, Hello, <laughs> Supreme, like stop putting American flags all over stuff, please, bro. Like it might just be me, but I hate the American flag on clothing. It just looks terrible in my opinion. Maybe I'm low key a Soviet spy, and if that's the case, drop a like on this video because that's lit. But this is pretty ugly, like. Stop, just stop it, Supreme. Nobody asked for this. Moving on though, we got the big letter track jacket and these are kind of atrocious to be honest. I'm not too big of a fan of these. Uh, the more I look at it, the more I get a headache. Let's, oh my. 
Dude, we gotta go to the camera. Let's go, baby. We got these some people that we are sitting in. Oh my god, that shit looks so nice. One sec. All you fake baseball fans, I just had to let y'all know we come in the Seattle Mariners way. We got that OG Mariners logo in the house. Ooh, that's why I had to show off this hat. The fifth pick inbound is going to be disgusting. Go follow my Insta. I promise, like, I'm gonna be copping so much stuff this season to post on the gram. I love this, but oh, I love this so much. It's so gorgeous. It's everything I wanted in a jacket. So we got a gorgeous, is that navy? I think it's navy. Um, oh, dude, I'm sorry, I'm still tripping on this. The lookout, oh, so hard. This whole thing is amazing. Now I will say, the Houston Astros patch, that's gotta go. That's cut the second we get this, but um, seriously, I love this jacket, dog. I'm a huge baseball fan. I'll say it right now. I'm a bigger baseball fan than any Supreme YouTuber out there. Like, I guarantee it because I've just been watching baseball my whole life. This is so appropriate, bro. Like, oh my, thank you, Supreme. Thank you so much. I There's another logo on. Damn, bro, like they really balled out on this jacket. Now, y'all know, I'm not much of an ARC logo type of dude, so this definitely could have been not on the jacket and I still would have loved it, but I mean, like, more shoddies finish season supreme, I ain't mad, like, uh, all right, let's continue. Let's take a look at these other colors. Okay, there's only three colors. Wait a second, this is a crime, dude, what? No, I saw the orange one initially on Sean Pablo and I was definitely hoping for some more colorways. This navy is everything I could have hoped for. It's my favorite item by far that I've seen already. Um, we got some track jackets. Not too big of a fan of these. Gucci colorway in the house. Not feeling these at all though, to be honest. We got some velour jackets. Nope, not touching those. Uh, oh my, bro, now this is a vibe dude now that is hard this reminds me a lot of when you're like in the city it's raining and lights are just reflecting everywhere this is gorgeous dude like i'm actually a pretty big fan of this if this is on a pair of pants they're already on the body like i've already copped them because i would love to see this on some denim it would look so sick bro like please supreme please don't let me down with the pants this season this is dope though like i love this jacket super sick dude the more i look at it the more i like it um we got what are these waves work jacket let me take a little peek at this puppy dude my internet's so slow please don't roast me but uh, i don't know bruh i don't know about this one to be real with you i'm not too big of a fan um i don't like the white going all over it a little too much in my opinion um i don't know it's just i i'm not feeling this one let's keep going really huh this is what we're gonna waste the fleece design of the season on okay why well, that's cool i mean smoke that like brick pack then supreme because this is not chill dude i do not like this at all this looks like some shit i'd see at a thrift and i would still not cop like that's a bad sign um no this is terrible is there anything on the back like oh shit okay you know what <laughs> Kind of hard, not gonna front. The front side's terrible, but that back side, dude, like that's kind of dope to be real with you. I really hate this bottom part though. I don't know, man, like still not gonna save it. Even though the back side's pretty cool, still not gonna save that design. Um, continuing on, none of these look cool. Oh, I really don't like that coach jacket. Uh, yeah, so the jacket department, not the craziest we've seen, but definitely like some pretty interesting designs. I would say it's actually better than last season's jacket department. Like I'm kind of feeling the Anorak, even though I don't think I'd buy it the faux fur is hard and they'll be varsity though like oh my god my life's complete bro but let's continue on we got the shirts we're gonna go through these pretty quick oh my crap all right we gotta go to the hype camera oh my god bro we did not just get this shirt dude okay so the daniel johnston this is not just a daniel johnston collab this is actually the design that helped blow up daniel johnston my boy kurt cobain was rocking that back in the day i'm putting y'all onto this history right now oh dude bro this is so fire like you know when i'm getting obnoxious the shit has to be hard oh my dude i want this all over my body this also reminds me of the frog from futurama that like or the toad that hypnotizes people this is so dope even the flannel colorway is gorgeous like supreme never does good flannels dude i am so proud of you james jebbia like i feel like james just graduated middle school with this design because my man just leveled up bro like holy shit this is one of the best Daniel Johnston collab items I have seen. For those that don't know, Supreme and Daniel Johnston have done so many collabs. Like, it's probably the fifth or sixth they've done. I have like one of the long sleeves from a collab that I love you design. RIP to my man Daniel Johnston. He's an artist slash musician. Um, just like a creative mind. RIP to my dude. He just passed away last year. That is so fire, dude. Like, that flannel is 
maybe the best thing I've seen now. I did not think anything could top that MLB jacket, but I think that just did. Oh my, no way, bro. Another, all right, we can see you at the camera. Oh my God, another, another one. Dude, that button up was just as hard. I gotta go back and look at it, hold up. Now, this is what I'm talking about, Supreme. I love just loud, obnoxious, abstract stuff like this. I've never seen this artwork before, but I'm super glad I have now because this is a cop. I'm definitely feeling this. Wow. Like, wow, Supreme. You took my breath away with that one. The rayons be hitting, though. That's super hard. I'm super excited about that. Um, otherwise, okay, the City Lights rayon fire. Um, we got Shea Guevara. That's hilarious. And the Arc logo. <laughs> Calm down, Supreme. I do think that 1994 is kind of hard, though. Okay, so the shirts are not really that hidden, but like, honestly, the Daniel Johnston stuff alone saved the whole shirt section. Let's head on over to the top department, you feel me? Um, okay, let's, uh, not feeling these. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. The cartoon sweater, let's take a look at this. Okay, kind of reminds me of some Slumpy Kev vibes. Definitely rocking with this one, bro. Again, please put this on Pants Supreme. If this isn't on a pair of pants or shorts, I'll, I'll take some damn shorts. I don't care, Brad. Like, just come on. Put them on some Hanes briefs. I'll cop it. Like, I think this is a super dope design. The more I look at it, I actually really like it. I want to take a look at the other color. This one is so much more boring. I wish they did more colorways for this. I definitely am rocking with that. Um, Star Zip. These actually are kind of chill. I'm not even that mad. Okay, the back logo sweater looks fire. I'm hoping that's embroidered. I'll guess it is. The cardigans, the CDG polka dot vibes. Not too bad. Like, I don't know if I'd buy them, but I'm not mad about them. I definitely have to take a look at what the hell this is. The Felitre Polo. This looks crazy, dude. This looks like some Cuban shit. Kind of hard, dude. I feel like I'm saying this over and over. Please be on a pair of pants. Like, I will take so many of these prints on pants. I actually think Supreme is killing the all over design so far. I kind of skipped over the button-up version of this, but even this is like kind of dope. I don't think I'd rock it, but I think it's kind of sick to be real. Um, this is sick. I don't even know what it is, but I fuck with it. Uh, oh my god, what is that? I don't even want to look at that. That is a nightmare waiting to happen. Racing stuff is hard. This is the worst hockey jersey I've ever seen. This is kind of dope. Oh my god. <sighs> Dude, we're really still doing Castelli collab <laughs> Supreme. Are you still? And they wasted such a good subway design on this dude. What even is this, bro? This is like, this makes no sense at all, honestly. Like you are mixing street life, like New York old ass subways with graph and shit with like cycling, like what? Like that makes no sense to me. I am bummed about this because I really like this print, but like you will never catch me in anything like Castelli like this ever, bro. Like, come on Supreme, can we just cut it out with the cycling shit? Thought y'all were a skate brand. Let's continue on. Ooh, okay, wait, this doesn't even look Supreme, dude. This looks like so different from anything Supreme. I rock with this. Some of y'all might be like, bro, Boone, like, stop. Stop it. Like, just don't do it. But this is kind of hard, dude. I actually think this is kind of dope. I will say the baseball shirts fit so baggy on me because I homie way too skinny for this Supreme shit. But, oh wait, I get, wait, are they different? This looks like some worldwide youth design or something, to be honest, with like the globe. I kind of rock with it. I think I like the other one more, but not too bad. Um, besides that though, it does not look like I'm seeing anything else I like too much. So let's go on to these sweatshirts. This should be good. Uh, all right, we're starting it off with this awful leak. I saw this one before and oh my God, dude, the font, dope. The actual saying though, so stupid. We want it to be known as Supreme, like, I'm sorry, no. I'm not quite gonna go to the hype cam, but oh, dude, this is hard. Like, I swear to God, Supreme must have gotten some new creative director or something, because a lot of these designs do not really look like the old Supreme, and they certainly don't look like newer Supreme stuff, which has been pretty garbage for the most part. This is very abstract. Like, this is not something I'd expect from Supreme. I'm rocking with it. As a former trumpet player in my middle school band i'm rocking with it miles davis is that dude um this is crazy with the butterflies bro on the cuffs butterfly cuffs dude. this is super sick i'm a big fan of this one um is there any other color wow dude wow 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 that is so crazy like i'm sure some of you think this is ugly i just I, this is so original dude i really like that the colors go crazy i might have to grab that that's super dope like i love it so let's keep going this is kind of decent. Let me take a look. It's like some Japanese. It's probably not Japanese. I don't know. It's kind of cool though. Oh, okay. The stars crew neck. Yo, it's kind of sick, dude. I kind of wish it was on the front, but I'm rocking with this. This is actually dope. It looks all embroidered too. I love this font, dude. I wish they used that more. Um, sick. This is actually a pretty good section so far. Um, okay. Maybe I spoke too early. I'm not seeing anything else. What is this? 
Naomi Krunek with my man Mark Gons tagging it up. This kind of sick, dude. I don't even know who Shotty is, so I'm a fake ass fan, but like kind of dope. I'm not mad about this one. I would love to see Gons just draw on more designs from Supreme because he's that dude. Um, but besides that, small box logo sweater. Um, this, oh, Ramelzi, 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 you guys are probably roasting me, but I know he's like a huge part of the history of Supreme. Kind of crazy to see Supreme collab with him again. I know they have a couple times. That's like a blast from the past. I'm sure a lot of these SS19 dudes don't even know what I'm talking about. Oh shit, fam. Here it is, the Motion Logo hoodie. This is a shocker to me that they actually came out with this. Like, I don't know how to feel about it. Let me know what you guys think. I'm sure some of you thought I was going to get crazy hyped over this, but I don't know, man. When it comes to Supreme re-releasing designs, like almost one of one, I'm not really feeling it. Like, I don't know. They've done like four or five releases of Motion Logo stuff. I think it's time to retire it. Maybe that's just me, though. I mean, this colorway, this yellow is definitely hard. Okay. They did kind of different colorways, so I'll respect that. But if they're gonna take like an old design, like the Motion logo, I'd rather see them put it on something different. Like when they did the Varsity, I was not mad about that at all, but they've already done hoodies, so I don't know how I feel about it. The yellow's kind of hitting though, bro. That yellow hoodie's kind of hard. Um, but besides that, like the S logo, we don't even have to talk about that. Oh God, the pants section, don't let me down, Supreme. I already know I'm gonna get so let down right now, please. Please, Supreme, don't do it to me. Uh, I'm not even gonna be able to afford those regardless. Um, okay, so far the pants section is looking worrying, bruh. I'm not seeing any of the designs I liked already on any of these, bro. Like, what's happening? Checks embroidered, let's take a look. Please, don't let me down. You let me down. I don't like those, not feeling them. Uh-oh, I'm freaking out, boys. I'm freaking out. What's going on? Where's the heat? That's it. That's it. All right, we're turning this into the rant camera. Are you kidding me, Supreme? Supreme Pants Designer, I wanna know your address. Drop the Addy right now, drop the pin, cause I'm pulling up on you, bro. What? The pants for the last two seasons have been trash. A homie is rocking vintage guest denim for like the third year in a row, begging Supreme. I'm, I'm on my hands and knees. I'll show y'all, I'm on my knees. I'm like, hey, Supreme, please just drop some pants for a homie to cop they're my favorite part of the season and y'all continue to let me down bro all right ran camera over oh bro are you serious are you serious supreme there's been so many good all over prints i've already seen and we got no city lights pants like where are those at i don't know they did do the miles davis and oh it's got that nwa font mm, gorgeous but I mean, like, I don't know, dude. I don't really like this too much in the pants version. <sighs> I am let down, dude. I am very, very let down by this part of the lookbook. Yet again, I'm kind of bummed. Last season, pants were trash. This season, eh, let's look at shorts. Maybe they'll rescue it. Ooh. Okay, this is a good start. These are actually super dope. I really like these. Um, very different design from Supreme. I'm not mad about these ones, all right? That's a good short. Bro, can we just retire the American flag? Why are we still doing this, Supreme? Bling sweatshorts look extremely obnoxious, no lie. And ooh, okay, the racing water shorts. So these are swimwear, so I don't even know, bro. I don't even know if I can like casually rock swim trunks like that, because I was hoping these were just normal shorts. Um, ooh, even, they even got like the blurred Supreme logo. These are really cool. I wish they did this on a hood. That would have been sick. Reminds me for sure of the Grand Prix stuff. Um, but this is crazy, dude. Like, the watercolor art on this is super nice. It's probably not watercolor. I don't know, man. So, like, when did Supreme become a sex offender brand? Because literally, what is this, dude? Like, I'm sorry. My man Borat was rocking this a couple years ago. I thought it was done after that. I thought we were retiring the banana hammocks. But Supreme was like, oh, sex offenders cop Supreme. Let's make this. Dude, are you kidding me? This is like... This is gross to even look at. Like, first off, there is enough crotch space for me to cop. You know, that's like a priority for the kids, so that's definitely nice to have, but like, bruh, like, you could not pay me enough money to cop these. If this video gets like 5K likes, I'll cop these. It's not gonna happen, so forget about it. But I mean, like the video anyways, but oh my God, what are these? I'm, I, we gotta stop talking about it. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. I don't even know what you're talking about. Let's move on. T-shirts, all right, I'm excited for this part. We have the Supreme Tupac hologram tee and I am feeling this one a lot. I saw the hype like a couple nights ago. I saw them talking about a Tupac collab. 
I'm actually really rocking with this. Like, this is way better than what I thought they were gonna do. I'm more of a biggie guy myself to keep it a buck, but, uh, oh my god, of course my man's got the Supreme Boxers on, bro. Tupac came back from the dead just to rock some Supreme briefs. That's for the culture. I don't know what else is, but that is for the culture. That's a crazy tee, though. I actually really like this. This is one of the best tees I've seen from Supreme in so long, dude. Like, it's been a while. Reminds me a lot of the Travis Scott action shaker doll for some reason. It'd be sick if they had dropped an action figure with that. Um, next up, the bling tee. Okay, this is like not really that dope, but I'm not mad about it, okay? It's not the worst. It's better than what I saw last season. Let's keep it moving. Okay, we got a little hand style going on. This is pretty wild. Like, I don't think I'd rock this, but I can appreciate the little hand style. My man got a little down with it with the underline. Okay. Uh, this would have been dope, honestly, if it wasn't tie-dye. I am not a fan of tie-dye stuff, but kind of cool. Like, not for me, but I don't know. It's not the worst. It's interesting. Yo, this might be the best tea, bro. This is so sick. So we got the Mark Gons over my shoddy Naomi. Whoever that is, I still don't know who the shoddy is, but... Dude, this is super sick. It looks almost like the Louis V monogram, except Gon style. Now I'm thinking like, Gon's has to work with Louis V because he can do their monogram almost one of one in this style. I love this though, dude. This is so sick. I just, I want Mark Gon's to just draw on everything Supreme because it would look better. It would just make everything look dope. I love this, dude. This is so sick, man. Call me a dick rider. I just love like everything Gon's does, dude. The dude's just so good at art. I don't know what it is. Eh, it's all right. It's, it's whatever. I skipped over this because like, bruh, I'm sorry. I love my edgy shit, but like, really dude? Like, psycho, ready, electro, murder, like, uh, okay, bro. Chill out, Hot Topics customer. You can just calm down. Black cat tea, let's take a peek. Okay, so another kind of cartoon item. I don't love the like, I don't know, the art on this one. It's better than any tea I saw last season, so I'll give them that. Um, masterpiece tea. All right, uh, this is actually kind of cool. I'm not even mad about this. I like the art on this one. That's a pretty interesting one. Um, we got like an old classic logo, very similar to the classic logo, except it says New York City, has their phone number, RIP whoever's phone number that is. And then the Laugh Now tee, this one's not too bad. So the t-shirts are not looking too bad, to be honest, for this season. I'm not mad about them, so let's keep going. We got the hats. I don't know if I can go through all these hats. There's so many. I'm just scrolling through, ooh. All right, by the way, my hype camera died, so like we can't do that anymore but these are hype camera approved bro motion logo beanies now this is what i'm talking about i want to see from supreme if you're gonna bring back the motion logo that's cool just do it on something different that's what they did here and these all look embroidered too <laughs> I love embroidered motion logos. These are super sick. I'm extremely excited about these. I look awful in beanies, so I'll never rock one, but I'll damn sure like to look at one in my hands because this is a gorgeous design. I'm trying to look at these other hats. They're so hard to see. I see some Ben Brims in the house though. Uh-oh, dad hat alert. Okay, Supreme, y'all adapting to the times finally. Supreme's only like five years behind the dad hat wave. It's so crazy. All right, so we're almost done with this video. We still have the accessories to go. The best part almost, but I just wanted to talk about this baseball hat as well. Well, oh, I love this so much, man. I need to get one of these navy colorway. Don't play games with me. That's a cop, but um, let's go into the bags real fast because I was excited for these bags. Um, we all saw Sean Pablo leak one of the bags early on, so let's go take a peek. We got the backpack. It's looking like a whole lot of mesh right now, and that's not what I was looking for. Uh, Little bit bummed currently, but let's keep looking. Okay, I mean, I like the camo color, and okay, that's a nice touch right there. All right, this one's not too bad. Even the yellow is like pretty chill, black boring. We always get a black bag, I'm over it. The red one's a nice shade of red, not that bright red, I like that. Um, so yeah, these are actually a pretty solid lineup of backpacks. Yo, that needs to chill, dude. The duffel bag, it looks like a cat carrier. I could legitimately carry my cat, and maybe I should get this for my kitty, bro. Like, low key, my cat would be flexed out in this when I pull up to the airport to take my shoddy to the Airbnb. I don't know if it's worth it though. That's a whole lot of money, but that's kind of funny. It legitimately looks like a cat carrier. Here is the waste. This is a waste bag, bro. I'm sorry, Supreme. You are smoking Thrax because this is not a He's waste stupid. bag. I don't know if you guys know what a waste bag is. First off, it's supposed to go around your waist so it wouldn't have a shoulder strap. Second off, um, it looks like you're about to go to the pool or something with this, bro. I'm not feeling this at all right now. 
Ah, uh, big bummer. This is a, like one of the worst waste bags I've seen in a while. Like, what is this, dude? We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. Let's go to the small shoulder bags. Please don't be mesh, and they're mesh. <laughs> Why is every bag mesh, dude? This is not what I was looking for. The camo still does hit, but I wish it was just like a blank, like normal canvas bag, not mesh material, man. That's definitely a bummer. Uh, we even got a utility pouch. That's so weird, but um, here we have a Vance and Leather um, letters bag. I'm not really feeling it. Uh, let's take a look at this. Nah, not feeling it. I don't like the body of that. We got a tote. Oh, ooh, okay, we just saved the bag section. Shouts out to Supreme, they did it. Um, this waste bag right here single-handedly saved the entire bag section this season. That is what we're looking for. I will say I could have gone without the extra Supreme spell outs. Just like the print on its own is gorgeous. It reminds me a lot of when I went to Guatemala my freshman year on a little exchange trip. Like I saw prints like this all over. That That's so sick. I absolutely love that bag. Um, they even did like another little coin one. That, those are sick. Those are super Super nice but let's go to the accessories this is the part I've been waiting for I've heard good things people have been telling me the accessories hit this season oh here we go workstation I cannot afford this that's all I know like no way am I gonna be able to afford this it looks cool though my dad has one of these but it's not supreme and it's not gonna be supreme because I cannot afford this looks super cool though this would be so nice for like putting like accessories or something in this is actually really usable bro like for accessories this would be super nice to display stuff let's continue though I know you tool boys are cringing because you're like, oh, I should put my wrenches in there. We have the 10 billionth Supreme bike that's ever existed. I totally needed this in my life. No, I did not. Um, I'm over it. I'm so done with the bike. Supreme is officially a cycling company. I don't care what you tell me. They only do bike shit. So let's keep going. Supreme Oreo. So I see cookie pack of three. That's a little disappointing. Like a homie's gonna need some more cookies than that. Um, these are sick though. These are such a flex. I guarantee when lunchtime comes around, if you pull these out every girl in your grade is about to sit around you for lunchtime. like this is an absolute flex i wonder if it tastes any different from a normal oreo we might have to find out on the channel um we might do a taste test oh god man now this is the worst thing i've seen from the accessories so far this is terrible i absolutely hate pendants that are horizontal like this it just looks so bad to me like these are terrible these are so trash dude i have not this might be the worst pendant i've seen from supreme that is horrible um let's keep going we got a turntable. All right, this one's not too bad. It looks kind of low quality to me. It looks like plastic, but I do wish they had done like a big sup over on the red on this. That'd have been way sicker. I don't really like the branding too much. It's cool. I could definitely use a turntable. So, I mean, I doubt I'll cop it. It'd probably be hella money. Um, binoculars for my peeping toms. Shouts out y'all. Oh my God, this is so original. Now this is the kind of stuff I love seeing from Supreme. When they come out with ideas that I couldn't even think of this stuff myself. Like, this is so smart. Um, this is gonna be Polaroids you can take yourself. Um, and oh my God, they're only giving us 10. So y'all can't mess up. Like you gotta kill the game with these 10 photos cause there's no redos. I gotta get a fit pic with one of these bro. These are so sick. I'm so glad they did this. This, now this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about Supreme. Now these are some accessories. Hold up. Hold up. Let, Let me, me get, get it started. started. BB, BB with the Robins. Robins. Look at no. I'm not going to say that part, but oh my god. Dude, this is so obnoxiously fire, dude. Are you kidding me? Don't play with me. I know some of y'all like, bro, Boone, that's the most obnoxious shit I've ever seen. And you're right. And that doesn't matter. I'm still copping this, bro. Like, I don't even care what you're going to tell me retail is. Oh, dude. Bro, all right. I think the white might be my favorite. The red, the. Oh my. They're Swarovski crystals, too. Bro, this like this is so it. This is what I needed in my life. Obnoxious Supreme accessories. Let's go, dude. This is actually so sick. Um, let me know what you guys think of these. I I am in love. I need a fit pick with my Swarovski box logo. Pronto. Let's go, dude. You already know I'm gonna have to rock these with my True Religion jeans with the Air Forces. Like that's a classic BB belt fit. This is amazing, dude. This is absolutely amazing. I love that. My favorite accessory yet. Lawn chair. I'm not a huge lawn chair guy. I do need another chair here, so I guess I'm gonna have to cop because it's Supreme and I need stupid Supreme shit, but I mean, it's not the worst. I'm actually pretty happy with the little design they did. Um, not bad, I'm probably gonna cop one. We got this blanket. 
Um, I like it. Like, again, gives me like Guatemala vibes, bro. It's got that Southern American little, one little flavor to it. This is really cool. Yeah, it's from Mexico. So yeah, shouts out my Mexican boys watching this right now and ladies, uh, my chicas. Ooh, bro, this is so funny. I actually saw this a couple weeks ago on like Depop. Someone was saying they're selling this as a sample and I thought it was just a fake. It looks like a Supreme Spain basketball. Don't tell me otherwise, because it really does. I'm not a big fan of George Washington and stuff on clothing though, so or it's not clothes, it's a basketball, but I think it looks awful. They could have used any other print and I would have liked it, but I mean, I'm not gonna complain about a Supreme Basketball. At the end of the day, it's a really dope display item. Might have to cop, really like, uh, could have been a better print. And, oh man, dude, they are snapping on the accessories this season. Last season accessories sucked. This season accessories are stepping it up. I'm definitely gonna have to grab these. I actually really like the way they did them. These are dope, dude. These are super sick. I don't know what to say about them. The plastic bag that says Supreme, we've definitely seen that before, but I mean, I'm happy it's in my life, folks. Woo, what the, oh, the Speedo goggles, bro. The colors on these, I already know. I'm gonna see the dorkiest fit picks with these, and I'm not even gonna complain, because it's gonna be a flex. Those are pretty funny. Um, the black ones are my favorite pair. Wow, bro. I already know some of you hype beasts about to be calling this like this is my utility vest, my tactical, like chill. It's a captor's protector. Let's not play games like this, some bulletproof vest, all right? I already know some of you about to do that. All I know is when I get on the diamond, my starting catcher better be rocking the Supreme face mask with the Supreme catcher gear. Like, bro, this is so fun. Shout out to the one person that actually uses this for its purpose. Like, you are the goat. Um, that, that's so funny and random, like, of all the things, bro. Um, oh my god. Did helmets just become cool again like honest to god i might just walk around rocking a helmet um just so it says supreme on it like this like i never wore my helmet when i skated and all that shit got a concussion so i probably should have but like if i had a supreme one i would have so a couple years late but i'm rocking with it these are hilarious i'm gonna have to cop okay dude all right i don't even this is like the craziest multi-tool set i'm not even mad about this one dude this looks super sick and it looks like this logo might not actually come off for once which is a nice touch because these little white logos they usually do on these type of items rub off so quickly they even got like a little holder this shit looks hella expensive it's probably gonna be a hundred bucks you got some work gloves and we're just gonna skip over those that was terrible that is super sick i did not like the other fish design but this one's super dope actually in the bowl this is appropriate i'm about to be eating my ramen out of that puppy that's sick i need that we got an ashtray let's see what the ashtray Ooh, okay not too bad it's all right. I kind of wish they had done a different interior, to be honest, because um, the outside, like, this looks dope, but it's not the worst. I do think Palace shined with their ashtray this season. I like that one way more. We got some incense burners. That's sick. Um, I like the stars. This is actually pretty cool, even though I don't use incense, because I would never in my wildest dreams light a match in this room with all this Supreme shit. That's just, like, not going to happen, but pretty cool. We have a woven mat. I'm excited to see this. It's okay, it's actually, I like it. You know what, it's not too bad. Um, I'm not super hyped on this kind of color it has. Transparent lock, this was a leak we saw from a while ago, and I like it, I think it's a really cool one. Um, we even got an umbrella, this one's fire. I'm a huge fan of this, bro. I'm actually rocking with this. The checkerboard, might have to cop it. I wish there was a little more Supreme branding. I feel like I never say that. We got water bottles, I actually like these water bottles. I collect like every Supreme water bottle, so this is like an automatic cop. I like the little cover on it, that's pretty sick. Um, glow in the dark zippo sign me up bruh sign me the freak up i love this dude like i know it's like a one of one replica of another um lighter they've already done i have one like way back here but i'm rocking with this dude glow in the dark anything i'm there i'm already there i love it um what are these bird call what is this like for rosen powder capsule and keyring someone explain it to me in the comments i don't even know what that is oh yes sir you already know espresso boys hype for this one this is a must cop i need to get these bro this is fun i'm just looking at all these brand new accessories and the party's over we wanted to be known as supreme like get out of my face please you just killed my whole vibe with these accessories because i just i hate that saying bro it's so corny i'm sorry ah uh, it's cool it's whatever i'm not gonna buy it i don't know um oh my god hanes shirts holy shit hanes tank top no one cares normal ass briefs sick oh course it is like the mlb themed season for supreme it seems like we got this ballpark poncho i have to cop i'm sorry you guys i was roasting the gore-tex poncho but like i'm gonna have to cop this one please don't be over like 30 40 bucks bro this shit is pure plastic supreme i know you guys are gonna find a way to jug beaded keychain 
those are pretty sick again dude a lot of like latino culture vibes from these items like i really like these this is so sick and i actually could use this dude like a waterproof lighter like keychain i could use that that's actually so tight i love these dude these are sick i'm so hyped on the accessories this season i love it i love it this is so sick dude this is like one of the best keychains i've seen in so long the front's keychain was probably my favorite they'd done for a while this um this probably tops that this is so sick <laughs> I love this season, dude. I am shocked. Like last season, I was ripping on the season. I love this season though, dude. This deck is so sick. But wait a second. It looks like that's on the top. So what's on the bottom? Is that the top? Or the, is this the bottom? It looks like it's the top of the deck, but I'm just gonna guess that's the bottom. I love this, bro. I absolutely love this. That shit looks so hard to me. Damn, I did not think I'd like the Tupac shit that much. That's hard. Ooh, even these are super sick. This reminds me of some old school Supreme graphics for skate decks. This is like this cherry one. That is hard, dude. That is super sick. I don't like the bling too much. This one is dope though, dude. This is actually a kind of crazy season. Ah, of course they put it on a cruiser deck, bro. Like, Ah, uh, I would have loved this on a regular skate deck. I'm still copping. What do you mean, bro? Of course I'm getting a motion logo deck. To be fair, I know a lot of you newer Supreme fans probably don't know, but they have done motion logo decks before. That's probably why they put it on a cruiser. Ah, uh, kind of a bummer. That red on black is so appropriate, though. All these colorways are so sick. Why did they not do a baby blue hoodie, though? Like, I love this color. What are they doing? Um, love those. I mean, I wish it was a different deck, but can't blame them. And these... These are the worst decks. I absolutely hate this. Looks like some awful Instagram edit of a Supreme logo. No, these are really bad. Really don't like the, <gasps> these is made up for the other ones. These are sick, dude. Oh my God. All right, these are so dope. I did not expect the decks to actually get me hype. The colors they chose too, like that orangish yellow, the like purple cobalt. These are sick colorways for the decks. These, damn, I love these decks so much. And finally, bringing back a classic, the pipe skate tool. I love this, dude, that's so funny. If you guys didn't know, they did, way back in the day, a super similar item that was just like a skate tool, also could be used as a pipe. That's so fire, dude, that's sick. The iridescence, a vibe. Oh my God, you guys, I almost completely forgot. The very final thing is these shoes, the Nike Air Force Lows. These are pretty sick, honestly. I do wish they put Sup here. Um, on Bapestas, they put Ape there, so I'm surprised Supreme didn't do their own little spinoff with Sup. It would have been so appropriate. I have heard there are red laces with these. I saw Giannis was rocking them. I think the red laces are so crazy corny, but I am a humongous Air Force fan, so I'm gonna have to cop a pair of these. Like, I already know, roast me all you want. I really, okay, it's a D-Boss printed logo. Okay, so I was gonna say, if it's just like a normal printed logo, it's gonna be bummed. I'm gonna have to cop a pair, call me corny, whatever you wanna say. It looks like a little Photoshop. It looks like someone just put a logo right on there, but I'm rocking with them, to be honest. I'm gonna cop them, screw it. Judge me if you want. Oh, the red laces look so bad. There they are. I'm gonna sell these red laces to some hype beast, but I like the shoe. That was a crazy long one. I've been recording all day for this, so I do apologize. You guys are probably seeing this the day after this released. My my bad you guys i just like wanted to actually edit this video and make it a banger so i hope you enjoy comment your favorite lookbook items down below also let me know if i missed any items i probably did i tried my best to get through this in a reasonable pace but this is a fat video so if you watched all the way through you are the goat you are like a day one supporter i really do appreciate it like i said at the beginning of the video join the discord for this upcoming season you won't regret it and if you want to be alerted when supreme has restocks just feel free to join the patreon two dollars gets you a subscription i love you all though spend your voice Boone, let's cook this season. Life cops every week. Y'all know the drill. I don't even gotta say that. I love you all though. Spare boy boo. I'm out. Let's get it, baby. SS20, we're finally here. Deuces. If I went